Hi everyone, uh, Tank and Leah here. Today we are going to be making a Instapot beef roast with red wine. Meet you at the pot. So in our pot, I have a little um, leftover garlicky kind of like ghee. We made homemade pizzas and we had some oil left. So I'm going to add the Tank has chopped up some onions and some garlic. Um, we did one onion and this is probably about four garlic cloves just because we, we love that. So I'm gonna put this on sear for about five minutes and get it soft. Meanwhile, I'm gonna season um, the meat. So our vegetables are how we want them and I have seasoned our roast. Um, I used complete seasoning, garlic seasoning, Himalayan salt. Um, I didn't really measure, I just eyeballed everything. And I'm now going to place him into the Nutri-Pot to sear him somewhat and get him brown like I like him. Uh, we're not following any general specific recipe. Just is just what we're doing today. Okay, guys, so we're still searing. Ooh, minus the steam. Uh, second time searing. And soon here, I'll share with you the liquids I'm going to be adding. I have some miso that is beef because we didn't have beef bouillon. We just have some woo, miso. I just melted it down and made my own kind of bouillon got jive going on here. So when this is done um, searing, to my liking, we have four more minutes. Then I'm going to add the broth. I am also going to add two cups of red wine. Um, we bought it and figured we cook with it because it's Cabernet and it's strong. We are at, hello, okay, we're at the point of it's done searing. I've got some bay leaves in there, some fresh thyme. I've got some red wine here that I'm going to just pour on there. And we are going to put this on slow cook. And I wanted to share with you guys the time we grew ourselves. So this is dried. He has to make it to a mason jar. And we're going to put this on slow cook for about four hours. And when it's all plated up, I'll let you guys see what we have. 